All right, good afternoon. So this is a new day. I wanted to record because we finally got the little sprouts table. Now, we kind of talked about this a little bit before in regards to us wanting to do more Montessori S things and add it to the collection. And a part of us wanting to do that, you know, one is definitely the whole floor bed situation. We are currently in transition to try to get Nala out of this room, out of her crib into a floor bed situation. We have Simi started setting up that room, but I realized I gotta paint the bed that I had bought in that whole situation. So it's gonna be a little bit more time for that. But um, I wanted to get the girls a weaning table. And if you do not know what a weaning table is, essentially it is like a small table that is, you know what, the, the main thing that I think about when I think of weaning table is mainly the chairs. If you ever had kids that have been in daycare, you might have seen these little chairs that have like these high sides so that they can't fall out. But the only place that I could find an official weaning table or Montessori style weaning table is on SproutsKids.com. Um, so I ended up purchasing their value collection. Now, if you go on Sprouts Kids um, and look for this table, it is expensive as hell. And it also takes six to eight weeks to come in. So you have an option where you could do one chair or two chairs and also one table grows. So the chair has leg heights and the table has leg heights. So it's adjustable and it grows with the kids. Basically, they have this collection for discounted rates. If they have any type of things that they feel that is not aesthetically up to their standards, they sell it for a discounted price and it usually takes like two days to ship versus the six to eight. Please know at the time of this recording, it did take six to eight weeks roughly to get a brand new one. But as you can see, as I'm putting up the screenshots now, it takes roughly about two or three weeks. Now, if you are interested in getting a table like the one I'm about to show you and you wanna get it at the discounted rate, please know that the exact two chairs and different table hikes won't be available all the time. It's one of those situations like as if you're going to TJ Maxx. If you see it, you get it at that point because it's not guaranteed that it will be available again. So I end up waiting and thinking that I had time to buy it at a discounted rate and I kept checking back after that. It had sold out and it took me roughly about two or three months later to be able to catch that same deal again. So obviously I grabbed it. It was roughly about $159 uh, rough versus the $229. So that is a big difference. It's worth the savings for me. But just note, if you do catch it, uh, get it right then and there. But at the time of the screen recording, uh, that was the only thing that was available for discounted rates. So um, I do recommend that if you look to look early, early, early in the morning, I just so happened to look at 3 a.m. and it was there. So yeah. So this is the box that it comes in. It probably looks hella small and it does kind of look small, but the plan is to put it here. I still have the little... <laughs> tower situation which she haven't been using uh, because we haven't let them in here but now it's just like protecting our garbage can because the kids like to go in the garbage can uh the biggest thing is we want to get rid of high chairs we don't want to do the high chair thing no more so i am mostly excited about that regard is that we can finally officially get rid of this now i may end up still keeping this one because it really helps me when it comes to doing their hair. So, but for this one, we're just going to get rid of this one. And however we choose to do that is how we do that. But let's go ahead and open this up. I'm very curious on what makes them feel like this is not up to standard. I haven't seen any videos of people buying the value collection of any other items. So... Just in case if you are looking, then you will know here. Me personally, I'm not worried about it because nine times out of 10, they're gonna mess it up anyway. So I really don't care what kind of, if they're scratches. Hopefully there's just not like crown or anything, which it shouldn't because they were making it and it just wasn't up to par. So let's go ahead and unbox this. All right, 
lead and I don't know if I mentioned this earlier but uh, this is actually the only site that I've seen a weaning table which is another reason why I think they are expensive I did see some similar stuff on Wayfair so if you want something that's a little cheaper I don't know about quality or anything like that you should check wayfair.com for like these type of chairs you can also get some weaning type chairs if you like that idea of having high sides I did see something similar on Amazon hopefully I'll remember to link it or if you are wanting to know what chairs I'm talking about just comment down below and I'll try to tell you which one I'm referring to but they do have plastic versions and I bought that on Amazon for like $30 so it probably would be smart to actually get some tools because I'm probably going to need something to put it together so far so good real wood i'm really excited to use this tonight actually because they're gonna be eating now one thing i did not like about the plastic chairs because i got them because they use them in daycare but i quickly realized that i don't like them which encouraged me to like just stop playing stop eyeballing this and buy it it's because I feel like it's too easy for them to move around and to not really sit in it and to get out of it. Even the well could like easily just flip it and push it around the room. Actually on the cameras at daycare, I see her pushing around her chair all the time. So I don't want them to think this is a game. I want them to know like, hey, we eat here situation. So. I just wanted to be a little bit more difficult for them to get out because I want them that when they're in here, they're eating. guessing that the blemish that made them do this was this little top mark I'm assuming if you see the two little brown dots it looked like from the actual wood but I don't really see no issue in it 
if that's what it is i'm assuming because i can't find no other issues and i'm totally fine with that like it's totally good so i'm going to go ahead and clean this up prepare the area and then we'll see what it looks like then But I guess that gives them space to prep in between them. Yeah. It looks cool though. It looks like a little replica of an adult table. Like we got our adult table here. I like it though. That one's gonna be Nala side. Be her ass, she don't get <laughs> It's different levels if they get older. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's like the middle height and then the top one is the top height. Nice. So, so on the bottom or something? Yeah. You like it? Yeah. So that is it. I feel it. I just like the idea of no more, no more high chairs and they could be at a table eating like they do in school. I want to kind of keep everything like unison and together. We got to get ready to actually pick up the girls. We've already shown that look like and it's kind of complicated to actually film that. So I think we can just come back when we get them and test out basically when it's time for them to eat. All right, so it is go time. I had to get showered, that's why I look different. And time to test out this whole thing. <clears throat> They're full ready. My big girl said that it's eating, look at her. Eating like a big girl. <laughs> good job, keep going. It's good. It's good. Yeah, look at you. We're finally getting them at the table. Look at it. Oh, Lord. This one over here. Getting frustrated. Was she doing it? That's how they learn. Oh, yeah. It's how they learn. It's good, Nala. Nala, look at the, look at the fork. Noelle, mm -hmm. stop playing, stop playing.